Hi, my name's Anthony Ward, also known as Ant CGI, and welcome to this series of micro learning courses where I will cover the very fundamentals of rigging in Maya. So what exactly is rigging? Well, it's the process of creating a series of controls which allow an animator to bring a 3D model to life. Imagine a marionette. Without the strings and the main control they are tied to, it's simply a puppet. But what they do is allow someone to lift and move it around a stage, making it perform. So they are essentially its rig. The same can be said for a 3D model. Although with it existing in virtual space, controls are even more important. If we look at an example, in its current form, this model can't easily be posed. We can move it around the scene, but the arms and legs can't be bent, not without physically selecting the components. But this isn't an ideal way to animate. What this model needs are various layers of deformers, nodes and constraints, terms which may seem very alien to you now, but they are in fact the foundation of any rig. These elements are usually hidden beneath a series of user-friendly controls, which are all the animator ever sees, meaning they can be left to focus on what they do best, breathing life into inanimate objects. What I aim to do with this first course is demystify the key components associated with rigging, showing you why and how we use things like deformers, nodes, inverse kinematics and constraints, while also introducing you to some of the tools used to build a solid character rig. Once those have been covered, we will go deeper into each area in the following courses. So, by the end you have a good grasp of rigging and are ready to explore more advanced techniques and eventually, build your own rigs.